Okay, good day everyone. Today I want to share about how the D HIK controller connect to the S system, S system system. Okay, for this MVR, of course, it's the HIK MVR and also this is HIK PDZ cameras. So this is like a PDZ camera. I use this PDZ model 4225 as an example for this uh, controlling system. But obviously, this system are already connected to exactly the same network with all the camera, MVR, and also a joystick as well. So all is in the one system. But these existing are running. That means that this camera are able to control. So you see my PDZ control, it's able to control already. So it's already able to control up and down, in and up already. So that's why this system with this system are connected well. Of course, by using basic, our basic fundamental, we can add camera by using it here. So we just add all, add all the camera located okay, here, it will be done enough. So that's why you can directly control the PDZ. So this time I want to say about how the controller of this controller connected to the VR yeah, system. So it's very easy. This this controller, when you turn on it, it will have activation. Of course, you need to activate the device from the beginning for, for your system. So I make the, I not activate the device, just put in your desired password. Two, three. Activate. So like this, PDZ already activated. So in this rate, because the P this is the new, so that's why it's connected to a network. So you have to change the IP. So you need to change the IP to the IP range. So my IP range is the 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 one six eight point zero point two three zero done, and the gateway as well. Since you do the gateway, you have to do the IP, you have to do the gateway. So, done the thing. So, that's why, like this, they're able to connect to their network. So, I enter the keyboard. Just now, I already made, made the password right, isn't it? I put the password inside. One, two, three. Okay. So, in this password already inside. So, I just remember the password because for me, next time, for me to easy to access. Got in. So, in the live field. So currently, I want to make a connection between this controller to this MVR. So you go to the menu, you go to the device. In this device here, do you have a, this add button? You click the add, click your name. I just simply put the MVR. It's your side, it depends. Huh? Okay, this IP, where I can get this IP? Because this is uh, the MVR IP, right? So, and this MVR, you just can double check on this network. This is an MVR IP. So you just put the MVR IP and the MVR password as well. So you go to LN to put the password. Okay, so verification code because this I didn't do any verification. So no need to do on it. So on here, you just press save. Our camera are connected. You see they have a channel six over here. That means the camera are already connected. So at this rate, at the live view there, of course, you can select the camera. You can select the camera to live view. As I'm going to play a uh, list, camera one, camera two, camera three, and camera four. Okay, if you want to see, play the camera one. Okay, here also can see, there also can see. So in this PDZ, you can click the PDZ. You can start to control on it. That means we are successful on, on control PDZ by using controller joystick without and just a simple configuration by using this joystick as well. So come to the playback. It's very easy because this is a uh, this controller. He have a display. You go to the menu. They have a playback. You just select the playback. Select the desire of your camera, so you can play back your camera. Wow, it's quite nice for the this uh, night environment. So the date also can be selected over here. So up to you. I want to select which day, which time. Okay. So come to this. We can use this joystick to operate the DVR. As I mean, you can operate DVR. Okay, this MVR already control this to this to this system. So I want to do a multi screen. You go to multi, ah, click the multi. They have a have a multi. As somebody you want to see camera four, click camera four. So he will pop up camera four. So that is an operation for the 
for the this whole the joystick controller okay anyway thank you for watching